Skills, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm okay. So this was your first date with this person? Yes, very first date. And he didn't mention that he had a girlfriend? Oh, absolutely not. So you had no idea? No idea. So you're out walking the dog, and when you started getting close, did he see the car in the driveway? I saw him look at a car before me, and then I turned around, and that's when I saw. Okay, when he saw the car, did he say anything to you? Did he explain he said like nothing. Uh, he just let you walk right up on it? Yep, exactly. And did he know she was in there? Well, he did once she rolled down the window and they all started screaming at me. Well, there were more than one. Oh, it was a car full of girls. She started yelling from the car or she got out? She started yelling from the car at first and then she got out and her friends were behind her and she came really close to me and tried to fight me. What did you do? I ran back to my car. <laughs> okay, so you took off? Yeah, I took off. Yeah, good thinking. Yeah, I thought that was the end of it, but... Yeah, it wasn't. No. <laughs> what happened next? She got my number from his iCloud, and she started texting me nonstop. As it turned out, that was the best of your oh, dating that was, experiences in the beginning, right? That was nothing compared to. Because the next one made you miss this guy. Oh, 100%. What happened on the next one? So I actually found my date hiding under my bed. Well, that's not how you met. I met him on a dating app. Things were fine. He seemed sweet. I developed feelings for him. One night, I decided to go out, and he's texting me, asking me where I am. And um, he's a little concerned. He thinks I'm with other guys, which I'm not. I'm with my roommate. I find my key card to my apartment is missing. I don't think anything of it because I lose stuff a lot get back to my apartment, go to sleep, wake up to him crawling out from under my bed and standing over me. So your key card didn't go missing, he took it? Yes, he stole it from me. Okay, you went to bed not knowing he was under the bed. Oh, absolutely not. He went into my apartment while me and my roommate were out. Okay, and he, that's your bed? Yep, there it is. So he hid behind those drawers for hours. Creep meter <laughs> is pegging over here. So he hides under your bed behind those drawers for hours. Yes. And you, you're you in bed asleep. Yes, he thought that he was going to catch me come home with another guy. That's why he did it. And what was his plan then? What was he gonna do when you? I'm happy I didn't find out. Did you ever report this? No, but after telling the story a few times, now I think I should. Well, there's a statute of limitations on these things. Yeah. And that's, that's illegal entry. Yes. And then it, he stalked you mm -hmm. in real life. Right. I mean, not just call, you know, texting you and that sort of thing. And you might want to consider reporting this and right. getting a restraining order or something on it because who knows what could happen. Exactly. So I, I want you to be safe. That's, that's the main thing. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.